Let's get a little practice doing the Khan Academy exercise, marking data on line plots. So right over here, it says Tessa measured the distance from her house to several locations to the nearest half kilometer. All right, and so they have different locations, and it tells her the dis it tells us the distance from her house to each of these locations. So from her house to the school is three and a half kilometers. To the library is five and a half kilometers. To the park is two kilometers. To the movie theater, four kilometers. To the post office, five and a half kilometers. And then they ask us how many dots should be on a line plot of these measurements. So a line plot, and they have one down here. A line plot. This is literally a number line, and what we do is we put as many dots there are at a certain at a certain point in the line. So if we have two data points at five and a half, we would put two dots right over there. But we'll get to that in a second. But when they're just asking us how many dots should be on a line plot of these measurements, well we should make a dot for each of these data points. And there are one, two, three, four, five data points here. So there's five data points that I'm going to want to put on my line plot. Then they say click uh, create a line plot that shows all of the measurements. Click above the marking on the number line that matches each measurement. Click higher to add more dots above the same marking. Click lower to add fewer dots. So they say that the distance from the school to Tessa's house is three and a half kilometers. So we would want to put a dot at three and a half. And I do that just by clicking, clicking right over there, three and a half. So that's one data point at three and a half, halfway between three and four. Let's do it for the next ones. Five and a half. That's the distance from the library to her house. Five and a half. And then we have two kilometers. Two kilometers. Distance from two kilometers was the distance from the park to her house. Then the movie theater is four kilometers. I wish you could see it all on one screen. Four kilometers. And then the post office is also five and a half kilometers. So you actually have two data points at five and a half kilometers. So right here, I've just constructed a line plot. At different points on the number line, I'm showing how many data points we have. So we have one data point at two kilometers, one at three and a half kilometers, one at four kilometers, and two at five and a half kilometers. And notice we said five data. We said we would have five dots, and we have one, two, three, four, five. One for each data point. Let's do this one more time. Well, let's check, make sure we got it right. Now let's do one more. All right, measure the length. Measure the length of each line to the nearest quarter inch to collect data for the line plot below. To make your measurements, drag the ruler on top of the lines. Align the left end of the ruler with the left end of the lines. Then read of the, le the length of each line from the right end of the line. All right, so really I just want to measure. I just want to measure, oh, this is, I didn't need to tilt it like that. I just want to measure each of these lines. So this green line right over here looks like it is six and this is split into one, two, three, four, and it looks like it's six and three fourths. Six and three fourths. The green line is six and three fourths inches long. So we have one data point at six and three fourths. So I'll put that right over there. Then we have the red line is, let's see, this is seven and two fourths, or seven and a half. It's halfway between seven and eight. So seven and two fourths, or seven and a half. So halfway between seven and eight is right over there. And then finally, I have the purple line. The purple line, let's see, that is eight and three fourths inches long. Notice I aligned it right at the beginning, right over there, and it goes all the way to eight. And one, two, three out of the four, eight and three fourths inches long. So let me eight and three fourths. So there you go. I have one line that was six and three fourths, one line that was seven and two fourths, or seven and a half, and then one line that's eight and three fourths inches long. Let's check our answer. Let's do one more. This is actually a lot of fun. All right, we got to measure things again. So let's see the green line. Green line is exactly three inches long. Three inches long, so let's plot it right over there. And then we have the red line is exactly, let's see, three and three fourths inches long. Three and three fourths, so let's put a dot right over there. And then the purple line is three inches long as well. So I have another data point at three inches. So, I have two in so two of the lines were three inches, and one of them is three and three fourths. 
and we are and we're done <laughs>